50th anniversary of the Endangered Species Act. So we visited the Southwest Animal Conservation Center to learn more about what the act does and the animals it protects. People don't realize that we're out here. We're kind of, uh, we've been told we're the best kept secret, which we don't want to be a secret because we rely on people knowing and loving us in order to keep our doors open. In North Scottsdale, tucked away off East Rio Verde Drive, sits the Southwest Wildlife Conservation Center, a place animal care manager Kim Carr calls home. People love our center because you do get to get very close to the animals, of course in a safe way. They are guided tours with a knowledgeable tour guide who's usually a volunteer. One of those animals on display is the Mexican gray wolf. That's right. We house 11 wolves, currently Mexican gray wolves, and we are really proud to partner with different organizations to help save these critically endangered animals. The Endangered Species Act is a federal law aimed at protecting unique plants and wildlife like the wolves. If it weren't for the Endangered Species Act, we wouldn't have Mexican gray wolves. I mean, this is probably the best example of the importance of the Endangered Species Act. Craig Miller works with the conservation group Defenders of Wildlife. Both he and Kim tell us, although sometimes they get a bad rep, wolves are actually a lot more like humans than you may think. Wolves are, are likely the most misunderstood of land mammals. They're just trying to make a living in the wild. They're just trying to raise their families just like a lot of us are doing. Which is one of the reasons why the pair encourages Arizonans to visit the facility. Places like the Southwest Wildlife Conservation Center present a grand opportunity to get closer to the wildlife, to learn more about their ecology and their value and the threats. So you can learn more about a protected species right here in our own backyard. I think that really allows people to connect with that personal animal. You can visit the Mexican gray wolves here at the Southwest Animal Conservation Center by scheduling a tour and getting an up close and personal look at the species. We've got all the information for you on our website, azfamily.com. Reporting in Scottsdale, Simone Cucarulo for Arizona's Family. That is so cool. Did the wolves howl for you? They didn't. I was hoping they would uh, because both Kim and Craig told me how magical it is yeah. when they howl. Uh, we were there kind of early in the morning, so I think they tend to do it later on in the evening. Yeah. Have you had a chance to get up, there, no, get up there? No, I haven't. It's really cool. You should take your son. It's awesome. Yeah, but those wolves are really majestic creatures, they're aren't cool, they? They're cool, right? Yeah. yeah, and it's funny. They're, they're misunderstood, but it's yeah. interesting to see how they've been able to kind of grow this species due to the Endangered Species Act over the years. So we want to thank uh, the Southwest Wildlife Conservation Center for having us out there. It was a really cool experience. Yeah, really.